I'm Skylar, and today we're going to talk about Flash on your iPod Touch. Adobe Flash is a pretty old technology at this point, and in its early days was awesome for doing video and animations in web content. When Apple designed the iOS, the operating system that runs your iPod, they decided that they actually weren't going to support Adobe Flash, however, because it wasn't really optimized for a mobile platform, meaning that it doesn't do so well with battery life, and that's why you often see complaints about Android phones getting such poor battery life. Also, it's uh, not the most secure animation platform, and so Apple really didn't want to open up its users to any sort of breach of security. That said, there are ways to play Flash video on your iPod. However, Flash animations and Flash-based applications on the web won't work. There's an application called Skyfire. It's actually a browser that will allow you to play those videos. And if you search for it in the App Store, you'll find it pretty quickly. Uh, it's a very highly rated app. It only shows three stars, though, because a lot of people download it expecting to be able to use Flash-based interfaces, which is not what it does at all. So if you want to be able to watch videos, and uh, there are a lot of sites out there that use Flash-based video, I'd spend the $2.99 for Skyfire. Uh, otherwise, you'll have to do some pretty technical stuff with um, Java and making bookmarks and stuff like that. There are a few YouTube videos that will walk you through this process, but I think that the easier way to do it is with Skyfire because it's sure to work for Flash video. I'm Skylar. Thanks a lot for watching.